So guys, so I'm on the mainland now, I'm over the bridge. I got a lift over the bridge here in Rosenbrode because it didn't look like it was possible to cross the bridge on foot. Maybe there's another one, I don't know. But uh, I'm heading for the coast and it's not very warm and it's windy as hell and it's gonna be an awesome trip. I'm in a little more lee side now than before. So it's not long till the sun goes down. Less than an hour I say. See, it took me a hell of a time to get here but that's a long story. I have my MSS with me, only the green bag and the Gore-Tex bag. I have a tarp, that means a plus palatka. And my pack weighs about 25 kilos at the moment, with 4 liters of water in it and blah blah blah. I have no lighters or nothing. And I have my uh, small Victorinox Pioneer. There's no map, only a memory. I've never been here before. I've been in Tolstein before, but never ever here. But it doesn't matter. I have a self-heating meal and I have some pouch of uh, I have a pouch of mountain house food and a cliff bar and that is it. And that's courtesy of BB, the guy who gave me the backpack. A little problematic here in the beginning. Don't mind the wind, I'll just show you something here. Forbidden to enter there. There's a sun over there. And I have to go over there and hike down that coastline. So I took it in the wrong direction. Well, not wrong, but I didn't know about this plant in there. And this is there. Werksgelände, getreten, verboten. Lucky me. We have out there. That's pretty cool. I'm finally over on the other side where I can head straight down south, and it's nine o'clock now. So uh, let's see what the night's gonna bring for the curious guys. Camping plus Sütel. Where I am, Sütel in the Holstein. Time for a break. Need to change my underpants. These ones I'm wearing are uh, socks. Underwear have been changed. And if any of you should think that this is some cozy hike, I can tell you it's not. It's cold and extremely windy. Very windy and um, I have to find a spot soon to get some uh, food and some coffee or something. But uh, the moment I have to hike the coastline down there. Maybe I just have to press through all night. I don't know, uh, I just had a stop a while ago and had some food and so on. Well, it's 20 to 2, yeah, that's where we are, Rosenfeld Strand. Now I am pretty done, pretty done, I would say. And the cool thing is, I don't know where I am, other than I'm in the right direction because I have not taken a map deliberately, because uh, that is awesome. But I will run into some area at some point that I know. <laughs> so yeah, see you. I'm there. And I will walk down here. Because then we're in Dame. And then I will go up to this Schismastrasse. This is gonna be a boring video of a actually quite great trip. So that's it for the video hiking part down here. Didn't went very well with the video. Uh, English captain ran into a railroad 
bridge in Denmark, so what normally would have taken me two and a half hours to get down into hiking position took me seven something. So that was not so good, and that's why I just had to hike through the night and everything and uh, simply just get here. And it was cold and miserable and stormy and all sorts of stuff, but uh, I'm here now and uh, hopefully we'll make up for the last video from the trip. I plan to do some coastline survival fishing and stuff like that. And uh, didn't work out. I just had to hike, hike and hike. So uh, that's it guys.